Well, it's been an incredible time in Puno, only for one day, but we did so much in just one day. Once again, Peru Hop has been on it, making sure yep. we are where we need to be. I cannot recommend Peru Hop enough to anybody thinking of coming to Peru, especially if it's your first time. For what you pay for, I have never received such service in my entire fucking life. <laughs> so now we're at the bus terminal here in Puno to get to our company translator um, to go to Cusco. We leave in about 40 minutes and we'll arrive at Cusco at like around 4.30, 5 a.m. The life of a digital nomad. Not bad. All right, we spent two and a half days here at this Airbnb in Cusco, and now we have a hostel booked for today. And it's a 20 minute walk, so instead of taking a taxi, which I'm sure is only a matter of under 10 soles, we're gonna walk because we're backpackers. I am hoping our new hostel has much better Wi-Fi than this Airbnb because, well, for my video making efforts, I depend on decent internet, so. Hopefully, uh, yeah. But this is the our view. Um, we dried our clothes right here. Yeah, I don't want to talk about what I tried doing here last night. <laughs> but this is our beautiful view. <laughs> and here we go. So we've been in Cusco for three days now, but I haven't really been making any videos yet because I've been catching up on my video editing. And uh, also give me a little bit of time to walk around the town and get a better idea, get a better feel for it. And I'm glad we're walking to our next hostel instead of taking a taxi because it gives us the opportunity to learn the city a little more too. But Cusco is beautiful, as hermoso. Um, very, very nice people. It's beautifully nestled in, in between beautiful green mountains which is different than the Rocky Mountains, which I've been used to for the last few months. And the food is amazing, uh, the culture. We even saw live music in a bar last night, which was just, I'll post, I'll post some of that. It was unreal. It was called Andean Mountain Music. And I've never seen anything like it before in my life. It needs to be at all the festivals that I love. Since being in Peru, we consistently buy these big waters because, well, you're not supposed to drink the tap water, so uh, it's very common to uh, have these big waters, but we made the mistake of buying this thing. That's, this water is cone gas, which means with carbonation. And, well, trial and error, all part of the experience. We've got a big old thing of carbonated water right here. But yeah, we're just gonna get to our new hostel and uh, cook up some of the produce that we bought from the San Pedro market yesterday, which I will make a separate video on the market. It is simply incredible. Amazing. It's amazing. I wish, I wish I grew up that way where you go to the market and you just get your fresh produce every day. We got fresh blended smoothies. Yeah, I want to go back and get a, it's right there. They blend the, the fruit for you fresh, right there. She was cutting it into pieces and throwing it in the blender. And oh, and you could customize it. It was awesome. Oh, I got a guitar store right there. Hi. 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 Hola. Hi. Hola. Hi. Hola. Hi. Oh. But yeah, Cusco is just amazing. Now I know why um, people talk it up so much. Yeah, we haven't even taken the time to really see any of the sights yet because we just wanted to get here and acclimate. Our first uh, few day, our first couple days here, we can really feel it cardiovas cardiovascularly in our hearts. Our hearts are just beating um, that much harder and faster just to try to make up for the lack of oxygen in the air. But once you acclimate, it gets a lot better. And I'm excited to get to this hostel and uh, cook some food test the internet speed and if it's if it's really good internet speed we might just extend our stay we made it to our new hostel and come check it out here's our room we have our own little private living room area 
which is pretty awesome. Standard bathroom, toilet sink, hot water, baby. And we have two twin beds. The double bed is a little small to be comfortable with, so Nicole and I are just way more comfortable sleeping on two twins. We're okay with that. And yep, that's our room. What's pretty cool is we got this little private living room area. That's where all the editing videos and we have some phenomenal upload speed here. So I'm pretty excited about that.